This moves tight. If I get a front headlock, my head gets in the hole, right? I start to circle, I start to circle, and he goes to his hip. What do we got? Cradle. Right, I'll lock up the cradle. I'll take him to his back and get the fall. Usually, guys, against the stud, that usually doesn't happen. All right? Gessler, that might happen. All right? If he goes to his hip, lock up the cradle. This is a really tight move. Once I step over, I let go of his head and get the takedown. Right, I don't want you guys to step over, keep his head, then the ref stops it for anything potentially dangerous, or if I twist his chin, all right, then Gessler gets a point. Make sure once you step over, let go of his head and get the two. But guys, it's tight. If your elbow's down, you're second to your hip and trying to chase that ankle, it gets really tight. If your partner goes to his hip, he breaks position. I'm here, I sag, I start to circle, he breaks position. Lock it up, he looks for the fall. All right, I would say 90% of the time that's not gonna happen. I saw a few guys, they land on their hip. If it does happen, lock it up, get the fall. If not, head in the hole, step over, and get the two. Let's try it a few more times. We'll bring it in, we'll have one more technique, we'll get to our drill. Let's do it, one, two.